I secured three top job offers at Goldman Sachs, Morgan Stanley, and HSBC. In this video, I'll explain to you my proven strategy, which worked effectively across three top major investment banks, how it worked for me and how it can work for you too. Investment bank number one, HSBC. So how did I get a job at HSBC, right? It's a highly competitive bank. It's a major European investment bank. They have offices all over the world, including New York, London, where I worked in Canary Wharf in the business district in London. Also, they have offices, of course, HSBC stands for Hong Kong Shanghai Banking Corporation. They have major offices in Hong Kong, in Shanghai, very highly regarded bank. Now, how did I get a job there? Uh, effectively, what I did was while I was at university, I applied for over 100 internships. So I applied volume there, volume in the sense of volume of applications. I applied for internships at all the major banks, including HSBC, of course, but also hedge funds, private equity, things outside the finance industry because I wanted any experience I could get. I applied for internships at Procter & Gamble, domestic in general, any type of finance type of role that I could get a job in, I, I was going to pursue. And that's part of the reason why I got a job at HSBC, right? So I, I applied for the internship there. I was successful in many interview rounds, three or four interview rounds, and I got a summer internship. I worked hard over the summer internship and I managed to secure a job offer at the end of that internship. And I went on to um, effectively work there for several years in their sales and trading division on the trading floor, spent some time in investment banking, asset management and private banking. Now that's a great option for you to consider, right? So what can you learn from this? If you are more junior in your career or you're considering transitioning career to finance, try to get any internship you can and apply volume in terms of applying for over a hundred of those on the weekend, make some time in between your studies or other work you might be doing. And then apply to as many as you can, try to Take any opportunity you can get because one opportunity leads to the next. And that will lead us to number two. How did I secure a job at Goldman Sachs? Now, Goldman Sachs was a bit different. I did have that experience at HSBC, which helped my CV. But I really perfected my CV and resume and put all the right keywords there, the right buzzwords that they were effectively looking for on this particular CV in terms of the roles I was looking for, which was around working in sales and trading, helping the, the, the investment bank manage their risk. So I optimized my CV and resume through various techniques I perfected over my 10 year career. And effectively, I put this on all the major CV recruitment sites, everything from Monster, Indeed, Read, uh, all the specific finance recruitment sites. And a HR recruiter from Goldman Sachs contacted me directly on the phone. They dropped me an email and said, OK, are you interested in working for us? And then I went through nine rounds of interviews, over five hours of interviews. And after I passed that, I got a job offer and worked there for three to four years. So what can you learn from this? Again, apply volume, try to make sure when you do pursue any type of new career opportunity, you apply for as many options as you can. In this case, it was me improving my CV and optimizing it and putting as many CV websites as I could. So all the recruiters could easily reach out to me when a job opportunity did become available. That's a good option to consider. Yeah, that's definitely something you should consider if you are, are applying for new roles. And if you want help with your CV and resume, reach out to me. My contact details are in the description. Leave me a comment um, and we can take it from there and I can help you get a job at some of these top banks. Now, option number three, how did I get a job at Morgan Stanley? Morgan Stanley, I got the job partly because I did have that previous experience at HSBC and Goldman Sachs. So that's something you could learn from. Don't always think, oh, you only want a job at one of the quote unquote top banks or top hedge funds. Any experience you can get. In my case, the early on experience at HSBC, it led on to future opportunities that really paid well, for example, at Morgan Stanley. Now, so in that case, I leveraged previous experience, but I also, again, applied volume, which means I was applying for tons of different opportunities. And I reached out to dozens and dozens of different recruiters. And eventually, some of the recruiters reached out to me and one of them had an opportunity at Morgan Stanley and another major bank, which I'll explain in another interview, uh, another video. Um, I actually was interviewing for two banks and one of them was Morgan Stanley. I passed, I think, three to five rounds of interviews and eventually I got the job offer and worked there for about four years. Now, that's another good thing you can learn from, again, reaching out to as many recruiters as possible. So just to finish up there, three top banks. How did I secure jobs at all of those? Number one, HSBC, applying for tons of internships and being successful in the interviews through strong interview skills. Number two, Goldman Sachs, by perfecting my CV and my resume and applying volume by putting that on many different recruitment sites 
and getting successful, you know, again, successful interview skills that led to the job offer. And then number three, Morgan Stanley, how did I get that job? Through some benefits of previous experience, optimizing my CV, my interview skills of my 10 years in finance, and also reaching out to dozens of recruiters as part of that strategy of volume. You know, you've got to apply for as many as you can, reach out to as many recruiters, be on as many recruitment websites with your CV as possible, and uh, really maximize and leverage your opportunities. I hope you found this video helpful. Check out the two recommended videos on your screen right now, the free ebook in the description, and I'll see you next time.